Hi everyone, it's Maya again coming at you with video number three. This is my final video I'm filming for today. This is my July favorites video and I am going to jump right into it. Um, I apologize, I did not get an opportunity to make this video last month. I was kind of running behind. I had just been busy, busy, busy. Um, so that's why I've done all three videos today. So I'm sorry if you're tired of seeing the same outfit. <laughs> um, but I'm going to go ahead and get started. So the first thing I want to show you is I did not do an unboxing on these because I've, I had them for a little while now, maybe about a month or two. And I just was so busy I didn't get around to doing it. And I really wanted to wear these. So these are a pair of Burberry shoes. And I ordered these pre-loved. Um, they were actually never worn. They were from uh, a seller on eBay, and um, they were new, and I got a great deal on them. So these have been one of my favorites for the month of July, and they are these Burberry Espadrilles. They are so cute. Absolutely love them. I am a huge Espadrille fan, and this just wraps around the back, and then it connects here. It's like a patent leather kind of ankle strap and I love 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 this wedge and it gives me a little bit of height but it's also really very comfortable I'm not a huge heel person I only wear them if I have to and mostly when I'm going somewhere and I'm sitting if I have to walk a far distance forget it I just can't do those anymore um, so you can see the Burberry name on there and the beautiful pattern Burberry pattern going across all the way through to the tip. It's such a great detail that Burberry does on their shoes. Really good quality. So these have definitely been a huge favorite, especially since it's been warm. I've been able to wear those a few times. Okay, so that's the first. Um, and then I've got another couple pairs of shoes I want to share. Um, sorry if I'm out of the picture. <laughs> Okay, so my next favorites are my Valentino Rock Studs. Now, I did not also do an unboxing on these because I've had these for probably a couple months now, and I just wanted to wear these right away. And unfortunately, I um, threw away the box and all that good stuff. So, love these. Probably one of my favorite shoes ever. So these could probably be like a favorite favorite, not just a July favorite. I have worn the heck out of these. As you can see, the bottoms are <laughs> really scuffed up already. I didn't get the protective cover for them. I probably should have, but it's the bottom of a shoe. I really don't care. Um, so these are the black patent leather with like that tanny pink color on the edge and the gold studs. Love these shoes. So comfortable. And so stylish. I always get compliments on these. So these are definite favorites. And then I want to give a shout out to a fellow YouTuber that I have come to like watching very much, Christy J. And I saw her do a um, video haul on some items that she picked up. And one of them was a pair of these adorable shoes. Um, these actually came from Walgreens. I want to say they were like two for 15 or something. They were very cheap. They're just cute little flats. I mean, they're really bad for your back to wear these, but I don't wear them every day, but they're so cute. And they've got, of course, the Chanel chain. So I've worn the heck out of these, as you can see already. So these are also a huge favorite for July. Now, I have a special little item that I want to share with you. I really probably should have done an unboxing on this as well. Um, but like I said, I've just been busy, but this is so cute and I have to share it with you because it's been on my desk since I got it. So this was a pre-loved item off eBay. It came in this beautiful Louis Vuitton box that has this huge drawer. I'll just take the little tissue paper out and that might give away what this item is from the shape here. Just to give you an idea, it's square. All right, and I got this gorgeous water globe. It is so beautiful. This I got off eBay, pre-loved, and it does have some sparkle in there if you shake it upside down. 
It's got the gold flakes and it's got a red Alma and it looks like it would be like an Empreinte Alma. And it's got the Louis Vuitton signature on there. It says Louis Vuitton on the bottom. Oh, there we go. And it is so beautiful. This was like one of those items that came, um, like that you could only get if you were a VIP. Uh, they probably had a special private sale for VIPs and gave these out as gifts. So that's not something you can just go in your store and purchase. So when I saw this on eBay, I snatched it right up. Um, I think I paid, I paid less than $200 for it. And it's been sitting on my desk every day since I got that. So that is a huge, huge favorite for me. Um, the next favorite that I have is this gorgeous Chanel quilted leather and the caviar leather um, iPad cover. Now I'm filming on my iPad so clearly it's not going to show up. <laughs> but I love it. It's got the Chanel logos all through it. Got one, two, three, four, five. Uh, card slots there plus your ID card here and it's really soft suede material real soft and then it's got the peephole in the back so you can still take photos and I like this because you can do a couple things I tend to use it like this or if I'm watching YouTube videos sitting somewhere maybe on the couch or in my bed I'll do it like that so love this. This is probably my favorite iPad case I've ever bought. And the next favorite is this gorgeous Damier Ebin um, pencil case, or I, I think it might have even been like a little wristlet. It's got the D-ring here. So I think you could attach a, you know, one of the um, drag-on straps or maybe a gold chain to it. And I got this pre-loved off eBay. And inside, and this is always in my purse, inside I keep in this little pouch a purse hook. If you're not familiar with these, they are so cool. You just slide this onto a table and hang your purse so that you don't have to put your purse on the floor. And it's got this really cute ruby on top. And then it's got a, a mirror inside. So cute. And um, just folds back into itself, and I keep it in this little pouch. And I also keep my cord for my iPhone. It's just like a little mini cord. I got it at Target. And I attach that to my spare backup charger, battery charger. I think I did feature this in a video before, so you can find that in one of my videos. But it's got um, this little button on the side and that shows four bars which means it can charge two phones or give you two full charges on a single phone so and I love this case um, it's got the red interior inside and this was made in France not sure if you can see that okay so this is one of my very favorite things, newest items that I got, that I've been using every day. And um, I think that's it for my um, physical type items, uh, fashion. Now I wanted to show you a couple makeup items that I got that I really like, that I've been using. Um, I actually featured these in my June favorites, but that video didn't turn out so well, so I'm probably going to take that video down. and. Um, it'll just be featured here so you don't have to worry about that so this is the bare minerals cosmet uh, excuse me complexion rescue BB cream and this is actually a gel cream and I love it it's just I love it it's just it goes on so well and it gives you that flawless even complexion I'm wearing it today and then on top of this I always put the bare minerals um, mineral uh, foundation on. I just dust that on my face too after I'm done. But I do find that you have to use a moisturizer. This does not take the place of a moisturizer and I was doing that with the Naked BB Cream which I was using before 
which is why I switched to this because I thought this would be a little bit more moisturizing, but I'm noticing that it doesn't matter. Either way, you still need a face moisturizer as a base before putting this on. And then I'm using the Spice 08, and that's my color. So, favorite. Been using that every day. Then, of course, Lash Domination by Bare Minerals. This is the best mascara I think I've ever used in my life. I don't have super long eyelashes, but you can see it gives them some definition. And they pop up a little better. Love that. My next favorite is this Mary Kay Brow Gel. And I think this is like a dark brown color. I've actually had this for probably a year or so. And I don't use it every day, but I'm going to start because it just keeps your brows perfect. Once you put it on, they are set for the day. So, highly recommend this. And I think um, that is it. And I just featured this in a video I did this morning, the Soft Lips. Absolutely love, love, love the Soft Lips. It's 5-in-1. Um, it goes on really smooth. It's like a mini EOS, and um, it's got like SPF in it, and it's got some other ingredients I can't pronounce, but it definitely gives you a very soft lip, and also smells good. Alright, so I think that is it for my favorites. Um, I did want to throw in this video that I am using this purse today. This is going to be something I'm going to continue to do in my videos. I'm going to add a purse of the day in my videos. I have no idea what this purse is called. I got this pre-loved. I can't remember. <laughs> I got the speedy version. I'm using um, my LV white bag charm on here today as well as my Henry Bendel key charm. I just thought the stripes in the key charm would be pretty on the purse because they match with the stripes. And then I've got my lock here. And I love this bag. It is gorgeous for the summer or fall. And inside you can see it's packed out and I'm using my Smorga purse organizer which I recently got. So I would have to include that as a favorite. It is phenomenal. As you can see, I've got it organized very, very well here. Hopefully you're getting all of that. I won't go through everything that's in my bag, but I will tell you I have a um, PM agenda. Um, you know what? I'll, I'll pull that out real quick because I didn't do an unboxing on this, but I got this agenda probably a month ago. And again, pre-loved from eBay. As you can see, I was very busy last month and I love this. I'm trying to remember what they call this. I want to say it's the Koala. That might be what it's called. Agenda. It's an older version. Agenda. And it came in excellent condition. I mean, like pretty much pristine condition. Um, the only downfall is I'm not a Hello Kitty fan. <laughs> Uh, sorry BJ Taylor I know you love Hello Kitty I should send these to you um, but because it came with the organizer um, or agenda I went ahead and I kept them in there and I'm using them no sense in the middle of the summer to you know purchase like a full um, Filofax or Louis Vuitton uh, refill since we're halfway through the year more than halfway um, so I just kept it and I've been using it and then you can see this was made in Spain. I think a lot of the SLGs are made in Spain and um, very good condition. I mean, it just has a little bit of scuffing on this uh, clasp here. Really nothing there. And then it has three card slots. I mean, it's gorgeous. I love this pink color. And if you saw my video this morning, you saw that I just got the Rose Ballerine key holder as well as the card case. So these all complement each other. But you can see the pinks are, are a little different. I'll give you a little bit better view. 
There you go. But I, I couldn't tell you what this pink is called. I mean, this is an older um, agenda. But anyway, love it. I've got some extra stickers back here, Hello Kitty. And then what's really cool is I was able to find a matching pen, like perfect match. This is a Louis Vuitton pen. And if you've never seen one of these, it's probably because they're so hard to find. And I also found this on eBay, and it matches perfectly. And it's got Louis Vuitton up here going around it. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to see that. And then this part twists open. And there's your pen. It is gorgeous. I was so excited when I got the pen. Probably more excited than the agenda. Because <laughs> they're hard to find. And um, really reasonable price. I think refills will probably be my biggest issue. But it's hard to find. And you do have to find a pen that is thin enough to fit into this slot. And Louis Vuitton makes them. But I don't know if they're still making this anymore. Um... And then Tiffany's got a pen that's small enough to fit from what I understand. So, there you go. So, definitely a favorite. And then, um, I also have a pen case that I picked up on eBay. <laughs> that's not a fork. This is a back scratcher. And I definitely should include this in my favorites. It's a telescoping back scratcher. I have the worst kids when it comes to scratching my back. If I say I have an itch, they're like running. They have no desire to scratch it. So I bought myself <laughs> a back scratcher. And I think these you can get anywhere. But I think this came from Bed Bath & Beyond. And then I actually keep two pens in here. Extra pens. And I got these at Walgreens. So cute. So definitely include this in my favorites. Um, so got this old school vintage pen case off eBay as well. I told you I've been busy shopping. I just haven't had a chance to share all these goodies with you. And then I have my insulate wallet with the drag on strap here. And I have an umbrella. I have my zippy coin purse in here. Some tissue. Sunglasses case. Um, and then I have my cosmetic case. I think this is the 19 size. And all of this fits so nicely with this Smorga organizer. And I don't know whose video I saw first on this organizer, but I'm very grateful because everything fits into this perfectly. All right. So I think I'm done with my video. I'm not going to go through details of every single thing I have in here but those are my favorites that I wanted to touch on I hope you've enjoyed this video I hope you've enjoyed all my videos and I hope that you'll continue to come back and subscribe and please comment and rate and check me out on Instagram uh, purse diva 38 as well and um, I just hope that uh, I'm giving you good content and I hope that you'll come back and see me have a great day thanks